Hey guys, we're going to be playing episode 2 of Game of Thrones, but I'm going to give you a quick rundown of what happened. Just give, give me a few seconds. Oh lord. Oh, no! Ethan! No! What have you done? No! But I don't Ethan! want a ball. No. But hopefully things get better in episode 2. Hopefully. Maybe. Probably? We'll find out. What is going on, peeps? It is your host, Keith Kinara. I am uploading episode two of Game of Thrones. I put in an edited part for the beginning of this video, explaining what went down on episode one. I played it on Twitch. So, um, this first half of the video is probably going to be like maybe 45, maybe 50, 50 minutes. So, let's jump right into this. I am the sword in the darkness. I am the watcher on the wall. Gotta say, I love Game of Thrones, but I'm very, very, very behind. Like, season four behind. It's... Uh, excuse me, shit. Oh, that was a good one, though. But, um, I am very behind. I did a, a live stream on... Uh... What the fuck was it? Li uh, Life is Strange. Did a live stream on that. Yeah. Watch this previous one. one. Yeah, that was fucked up. Duncan, I've decided to name you as my sentinel. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rashid. Mm -hmm. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. I didn't say that. You can be my highborn ward. And then this shit happened. Uh, Ethan. Uh, no. That was fucked up. Don't let them take uh, me. Uh, yeah, the foresters. They're going through some shit right now. Like some some very, very bad shit. Um, also, I want to state that um, I'm still not going to be uploading every day. Um, I'm going to be uploading once or twice a week. Maybe. So we got the homie Asher. What the fuck? That's one very dangerous looking uh, scorpion. With no eyes. Come on, give it the look. Oh. I I'm shocked that scorpion backed away like that. That man has some real brawn. So what's 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 the story behind you, Asher? Whoa, it's just me, Beska. You yeah, put your shit away. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. Yeah, because this is like the certain place where you should drink your uh, you can stop ale. pacing. They'll be here soon. Yeah, sure they will. Anyways, fuck that. Let's this look at this. This is weak compared to Northern Air. Uh-huh. Okay, so what do we got to look at? We got uh, lots of shit to look at, right? This What's this? Shut up, Beska! Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it and find out. Um. Yeah, let's not taste that. Uh, this. Now, this is blood. Beska, it is from us. How don't you know? You're useless, Beska. Fragrant. Hookah. Yeah. I'll, I'll take that hatchet, though. Looks useful. Yeah, that's right. You saw me take that. Uh, the damage. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. No, not by a long shot. But I have to say, I'm 
I'm very impressed by what they've done with this game. First, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna let you know now. The hey, first episode shot the fuck out of me. Yellow comes out yellow, waste time even drinking it, you ask me. That's gross. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. Right? I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves and murderers and other deadly bastards. What are you guys? You should feel right at home. Oh, I know I bitch. Do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. You know, I'm not really a bastard. You're right. my kind of bastard. It's half the reason we're friends. True. Another round? I think I'm gonna like you, Beska. So yeah, uh, we're just gonna not notice the fact that nothing came out of that cup. Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? We got a guest. See if he's still breathing. Holy shit! What the fuck did you guys do? How's he doing? We need him alive to collect his bounty. Uh. Let's kick him. No. Ah, he's alive. Does Asha scare you? <laughs> you should see him when he's angry. Urgh. Angry man! Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. Yeah, I don't think none of us needs that. They say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines. Best whores. So what are you going to do with a whore? Please. Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't Wait, spend why do you need whores? We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin, we could do Maybe he, I can understand why he Go needs anywhere. a whore, but you? What, a male whore? Could afford passage back to Westeros. See my family. Oh. oh. Nothing from my family in years. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go home. They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. <coughs> I mean, that's no different from what people in Japan do. Hey, he got lucky. He got banished. Who fucking cares? It's all an excuse to tell everyone else what to do. It's not, not that simple. simple. In the know? north, these feuds run deep. Oh, fuck the north. That's my home, bitch. Watch your mouth. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. I hope you're Let's right, Beska. To all of us deadly bastards. To us. To us. Aye, to us. Press push to us. Try ah! There we go. Yeah! Come by! Wait, come by! Come, come by? I, I, that's the Japanese, you know, version of Cheers. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Is that Tazal? From the Volantis job. Maybe Watch out, fuck up somewhere. I told you if I saw you again. It's all. Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I cut your fucking throats. I don't say balls. Uh. Good to see you too. Good to see you too, Tazal. Where is he? Where's who? He's back there, you fucking asshole. Here. Four hundred dragons. They must be working for the wise masters. And that's all you're getting. Fine. Fine. We'll take it. We'll take it. Asha, no. Good. Now, show me the fat man. This fat ass should be back there, dude. I mean, I, I, I got a feeling I shouldn't trust them, though. Don't do anything foolish. We're all sell swords, Tazal. We are nothing like you. You sure about that? Because you look kind of like one of us. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Oh! Well, uh, fuck the bounty then, I guess. And we're done with you, too. Uh, what the fuck have you done? What the hell have you done? Yeah. You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The 
wise masters will hear how Asha Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he took Bullshit. 400 gold dragons and then killed Bezak anyway. Me. Luckily, we You dirty rag bastard. Justice. So you steal the money and we get the blame. Oh, you're gonna regret that, you son of a bitch. You know what? How about... Fuck this shit! All right. Who yeah. Show him, Vesta. Oh shit, that double sword action. Okay. Ah, take it, bitch. Ugh. Now that is what I'm talking about. Woo! Yeah. Hey, like that shit. Come on. Right in the chest. Plate. Ah. Whoa, whoa. I don't think so. Uh. Oh fuck, my sword! How dare I! Woo! Uh, that guy. Oh fuck! Uh, ba oh, Becca. You, 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 honey, you honey bear. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just tomahawk the shit out of him. You want some of this to all? You want some of this? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! Dagger right in the side! Oh, that's not Tazal, never mind. That's Tazal. The very important looking fucker. I almost said do a barrel roll. Nope, nope, I don't, uh, nope, fuck off. Fuck you, Ah! Give me your, your fucking hand! That is your fucking hand! Woo! Uh, oh! They have a very funny way of killing in Telltale no, games. Me of <laughs> that brothel in Norvos. You're still alive? We can fix that. You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. I'm ready to risk that. That's a risk I was willing to take. Tassol! Tassol! That's right, we fucking killed him! Oh shit! Oh! Ah! Uncle Malcolm! Yeah! The party? Oh! Shit! My uncle! My uncle, Uncle Malcolm. That ended well. More on their way. We need to go. But we took out. We took care of the trash. Don't don't grab that. Don't grab it. Don't grab it. You grabbed it. Why? Come I feel on. like we got played. Malcolm. See? Damn. See, we got played. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan said me. I'm here Ethan. to bring you home. It's gonna be fucked up when he actually finds out what happened to his brother Ethan, man. Because that was really fucked up of Ramsey to do him like that. And uh, Ethan wasn't even really a fucking a king, a king long. You know what I mean? So, hopefully the things... I hope things get better for um, the, the the Foresters, man. After the dad died, and Roderick died, and, well, I don't know if Roderick is really dead or not, because, I mean, a horse fell on him. But, I, I mean, a horse probably weighs a ton. So, I don't know. And then you got Ethan. I think Ethan was, like, 13, maybe 14. But, like, hope hopefully this shit gets better, and then Marie... Mar Marie? Mar Marie? I think that's the oldest daughter name. Hopefully we can find a way to be in King's Landing and actually be of some fucking support because we're the only forester that's not able to do anything to help anybody back home. You know what I mean? So hopefully we can do some shit to actually keep the family safe 
from afar. You know what I mean? Episode 2, The Lost Lords. Okay. I'm looking forward to this episode. Because the first one was very, very sad. So what we got right here? Roderick? What? What's, what's going on? The homie Roderick is alive? The fucking homie Roderick is alive. I was, I was like, well, I knew you couldn't have died from getting, like, fell on by a horse. I mean, he, oh, yeah, he's badly hurt. So there isn't much he could probably do. My God, his face is horrible. Um. Oh, he can't speak. He couldn't hear you. You talking shit, man? Hey, Dad. I don't. Should I? Oh, okay. Oh. Fuck. I mean, I knew he was dead, but still, if he would have pulled through like like Roderick just fucking did, that would. Oh, oh, is he? Is he? Oh, okay, he's blacking out. Okay. I'm gonna say, like, you fucking pulled through like uh, Roderick did. That would have been fucking amazing. That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you Come on, Roderick, pull yourself together. You again. Uh, uh, you this time? Some poor peasant dressed up like a lord. Uh, so royal. I was... You did this at dusk and day, and the, you have the fucking oh, souls to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many. Oh shit! Ah, uh, yeah. And you dare come here claiming to have forest today? The forest. Look at the colors, Lee. Now, Boy, wait. We're I'm sorry, Royal. Shit, stop! I'm alive. God damn it! You come back here again. You won't be leaving. You got that? Come on, oh, Roderick. Oh, you oh, got this. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Roderick. I mean, Sir Roiland. This one's still alive. You there? Who are you? It's me, Roderick. It's me, Roderick. I'm alive. Roderick, by the gods, it is you. Sir? Fetch the maester, hurry! I'm fucking alive! Roderick! <sighs> he blacked out again. I mean, that's understandable. He he was fu he went through fucking hell. He was passed out from from wartime to fucking now. Oh shit, what's is he getting sur is he getting surgery? Oh yeah, surgery, yeah. Damn man, this is all some old saw shit right about now. Shit sounds painful as fuck. Oh, he heard Garrett. The last voice he heard was Garrett. The milk of a puppy. Drink. Come now. No, no. Don't be stubborn. Roderick. My lady. <laughs> I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. How is he? Uh, yeah, let's see mom, let's see her. <laughs> Sir, my lady, I must insist that you leave. <laughs> Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. That's true. As it is, you may never walk again. For real? Roderick? <gasps> He refused the milk. Uh, uh, That's Roderick for you. Brave as always. But the pain must. Uh, Roderick. Oh, fuck! He might pass out from the pain. Roderick. Yep. <laughs> this must be Talia. Baby sis. I hope those wounds on his face end up healing. 
like to look like a battle scar like well of course yeah he looks fucked up that must be like his skin his skin must have been decaying because of that's how badly he was passed that must have been because of um you know because of him being passed out shit Morning, Good morning, Talia. Tell you. Good to see you again. Roderick, thank the gods. Hey, 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 oh, hey, hey, you. hey. Pain. Sorry, the pain. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Are you all right? Fuck it. Give me a hug. Come, here, come on. I, I missed you. How bad is it? Fucking bad. Least all Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. We're gonna prove that guy wrong. I felt worse. As bad as I feel. Yeah. But it's good to be back. Well, at least you look better than you did. Yeah, cause you did look like a corpse. Roderick, well, something you need to know. Ethan. She's dead. Ethan. Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. And he felt intimidated through by a kid. Ethan? How could this happen to him? I can't believe he's gone. Me neither. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove alongside father and now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral i can't you uh, this is this is fucked up no cry you're stronger than that because look i don't want to get emotional through this playthrough god damn it i don't who the fuck are that who the fuck is that it's been chaos here since he died We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still I need mean, time to heal. Yeah, I was gonna say, Go like, they can't it, expect too much out of him. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but... If you think you're ready, I want to go. Can you even stand? I mean, I can try. He can, I can try. But if you're not ready, let's let's find, find out. out. It, it doesn't really too much look like it. I mean, he can Are sit up, which is fine. Because everybody thought Roderick was fucking done you for. Can do this, Roderick. I know you can. Tally, don't don't expect too much out of the man. You remember he he's okay. Baby steps, man. Baby steps. Now try actually walking. Ah, fuck. Roderick. Fine. You don't look fine. Why are you shutting the door? Why'd you do that? Right. I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. It doesn't matter. I don't care about that. Let them see me. Right. But you're the lord of the house now. You must appear strong. Solid. You can't do that on the floor. It's a long way to the Great Hall. Uh, we can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Um, Let me help you. Yeah, yeah. It never hurts to rely on others. Thank you, Talia. Thanks for being a good sister, Talia. Ready? Thank you. Let's do this. 
Yeah, never hurts to rely on others. But here's my thing. I, I, I hope they don't rely on Roderick too much. Like, he just technically came back from the brink of, like, so utter so death. Glad to see you up. Though, I think you'll find that much has changed. So, I, I, I think maybe they should just let him be, let him be. But then again, so much has happened. Ethan, their dad. Okay, fucking Garrett. He got sent to the wall, which is bullshit because Duncan, I feel like Duncan didn't really, I don't know. <coughs> Excuse me. I think Duncan was being too much of a pansy. I feel like I should have made Ramsey. Uh, so, so Ramsey? No, not Ramsey. Rayland to be the uh, Sentinel. But I don't know. Whoa. Always I can always change it. And not like this. Recruits at the gate. Yeah, it's fucked up that he got sent here for avenging his father and sister. Your brother, Duncan. So, I, I don't fucking know, dude. I'm here. I'm queer. Let's do this. I was joking at the queer part. So, hopefully you know that. You arrival, is it? Another yeah. one for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. Fuck is that supposed to mean? What was up with the walk here? Fuck no. It looks cold as balls there. I'm gonna eat myself a Twizzler now. Cause I mean, I fucking love Twizzlers now. Hey, what the fuck? Hey, dude, hey, hey. Watch it. Get your punk ass beat. That fucking... Like it was built by giants, doesn't it? Oh, You're God. New. Here to take the black. Cause you got uh, that look about you. Yes, I am. I who's in charge? The Lord Commander. Yeah, who's in charge of this bitch? Don't have one right now. It's Frostfinger you want. He'll get you sorted out. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't what? let them scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice. That's I am. Not so good round here. I'm a pretty nice guy. You know? I have no reason to be an asshole. Let's uh, expect these guys. You fight like a girl. That's a fucked up. Girl, maybe. Can I teach keep looking? Oh, I'll teach him. Don't y'all are doing the same techniques. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. It did. <laughs> <laughs> it did. All right, look at these barrels. How about I touch the barrel instead of just looking at it? Huh? It's warm. Probably got some, some some fire in it. Maybe I don't fucking know. Let's use these stairs to look at old frostbite. I mean frostfinger. Whatever. That's why he's called frostfinger. Okay. What's up, Grizzly? Your frostfinger. You recruits. You come, what? You train. You fight. You die. That's who are you? An boy? understatement. Um. I'm Gary Tuttle. Yeah. Refute to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Mm-hmm. Gary Tuttle of Ironrath. Yes. And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the war? You a thief, a raper. You abandon your post, or do you just fancy dying someplace? I killed the bastards who murdered my family. My family. Yeah. Then you know how. To right on point. At least. You're no liar either. Of course not. I have no reason to lie. Sir. From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forrester. See, I told you nothing my but the truth. To the night spot. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You don't know everything about me. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. 
Yeah. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. Okay. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. A who? You mean a coat? So did he make their face a lot? If oh, oh man, if I oh sooner or later, the night's watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. Oh fuck you, dude! Aren't you destined in my future? But if I had a face cam, I, I would definitely make the face Garrett makes all the fucking time. And last we'd heard, Asher was in Slavers Bay. So Malcolm caught a ship headed for. I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <laughs> and he's missing his arms and legs. <laughs> Y'all talking shit? At least he can still eat his shit. The White Hill soldiers you know are what? You know what? And we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. Yeah, fuck these, get these assholes, man. I'm not worried about them. Let's just, let's just get me to the Great no, Hall. I say he's dead. So we can discuss shit. Let's stop some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? And bring you some salted pork while you're at it. Salted <laughs> pork. You lazy fuck. That actually sounds kind of gross. Is that him? Has to be. Doesn't yeah, it? it's me, you drunk fuck. He's hideous. <laughs> yep. Yeah, you ain't a pretty picture either, you asshole. And he's leaning on a gut. Should have buried him with the corpses. They're talking a lot of shit. Don't let go of your sister now. At least one guy showed some sympathy. Real shame about my leg. I'm like, okay, yeah, yeah, that's true. I did get stabbed in the leg by one of you fucking assholes. At the fucking traitor uh, of the of the twins. In the great hall. <laughs> you ugly bitch. Go around. It's like that. Don't fucking you test, don't me. test me. I may be a cripple, but don't test the cripple. Pretty sad to me. Okay. The fuck are you an arsehole gonna do? An arse. A bunch of arseholes. I wonder what's weaker. Your legs. Or this house. You know what? Move. Move. Now. Get the fuck out of the way. Before I show you what this cripple can do. Oh, That's right. My you funny face looking bastard. Yeah, like I said, I hope things get better for the foresters. Because er since episode one, <sighs> they've been going through hell. Ethan, like I said, Ethan and the dad. That that nobody deserves to have their little brother killed or their son killed. You know what I mean? So that that that's it's fucked ridiculous. up. You're treating them like the wine guests. keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool. Sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel. My lords. I'm not gonna lie, I probably made a mistake on that part making you sentinel, Duncan. Just saying. Roderick. Hello, mother. My boy. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda worry about her. Like a lot. Come join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. I mean I don't think she would have made it back in time to tell you that. Just saying. It's good. It's good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect Thank you. yourself soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking. If you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I told you he'd be up and about. I'm only he barely walk. walking. I can barely stand. Well, you're here at least. And a good thing, too. Indeed it is. Oh, come on, guys. Royal and, told me and Duncan. That house. And you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think... I don't think that's going to be a good thing, lords, though. Please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. 
At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay stole I've told you. I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a hostage. And what have you done to get him back? Nothing. Because we have no army. It's because you have no balls. All right, shut the fuck up. I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. Nobody's to bl the well. Of my brother. I'm not gonna say that. Fight ourselves. And we should be fighting them. We need an army to win that fight. If we don't have well, one, not anymore. Then find me one, sir, Roy. Right, you're no protesting sin. about Come it. On, well, Most then don't protest about it if you if you don't have anything in mind. Well, fuck us right up. You forget the, the Alps. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already if not for the war. And her father is no. I think coward. I know who that is Nothing in the actual turned. series. The marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady mm. Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way. I'm not gonna lie. Last. This shit looks Thank grim you. for the foresters, but I don't know. Down. He's barely recovered. I mean, she shouldn't see me like that. My son, I understand your doubts, but if she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground. Yes, this marriage could be our Hold on, I'm just gonna pause real quick. So, I wanna talk about... So, after playing episode one, and also doing episode two, so, well, so far of episode two, Here's my thing. Everything went to shit when George or Gregor, when, when Sir Forrester, the, the main house, Gregor, the, when Gregor died, everybody thought shit was going to go down. But then you have Roderick, the firstborn, who's like a second, who's like the second coming of his father. Stern, brave, level-headed and not too reckless and then you got Asher and then you got Ethan and then you got Talia my Mia Maya whatever fuck her name is and you got Ryan so but then here's the thing right here it's sad that Ethan is dead because I think Ethan would have had a lot of potential but my thing is now that Roderick is back and he's not dead I feel like they're going to expect way too much of a man who's currently broken at the moment. You can't expect something that's broken to be fully ready to get back out there. Or to be ready to work as functional as it did before. You know what I mean? So, as like my take of, of, of episode 2 right about now, I can understand why everyone is so desperate. You know, we don't have an army. Uh, we just lost two heads of the uh, of the uh, family, Gregor and Ethan, who was technically going to be the main because Asher got sent away, and but he's coming back, but he got sent away, and then Roderick was presumed dead until this morning. So I can understand why everybody's in a panic, but still, you can't expect too much from a a, a broken man who's in recovery. So hopefully they don't expect too much of Roderick. I, I'm, a, I'm, I'm hoping they don't because that's just I feel like that's just going to make the situation a lot worse in my opinion but let's get back into it of course we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick we Talk gotta take marriage, that into account too Ironwood contract. I'm so I'll convince her. convince her she's always been fond of you just be careful not to push Elena too hard right right if Elena does come to Ironwood see those soldiers in the courtyard we starve them out and they'll have to leave i'd rather they be lying well, around if, drunk than well if we starve them out life. then my lord perhaps it'll have a negative consequences just handle it knowing. just handle it we could keep them fed or take away, take away the wine that'll be something at least good now better than nothing. nothing more to discuss Maester, 
It's time to light the Ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, bro. It's got to be back. Get another Twizzler going here. Get that Twizzler action. Also, I bought some devil food, uh, chocolate, uh, cookie cake. Oh my god, they're amazing. Foresters have a way. And now we like them for him and Ethan. Again, that's fucked up what happened to Ethan. I, I feel for Talia. And, 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 and the mom. me with music. It's not the same without him. You must be strong. Everyone knows. Do it for Ethan, you know? I'm sure it will honor him well. Mm-hmm. You just gotta be strong, baby girl. You gotta be strong. I've sent a letter to Mira. Mira, that's her name. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. I fucked up on the first episode, I really did. But that evidence was erased when I did it on Twitch because Twitch doesn't save videos. So <laughs> Alright. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. Okay. Is that the letter to the orphanage? The yes, actual please. actor for uh, Marjorie it's is actually pretty fucking hot. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. Okay. And mm, something nice after that. Sorry if I'm smacking or chomping a little, little bit. Um. Lady Marjorie we'll intends visit. to visit again very soon. Lovely. They'll be pleased to hear that. I'm glad I chose the right thing to say. What she... I had to borrow that from father. Mine was stolen. Can you imagine? Oh, uh, wow. Um, oh no. What I feel terribly bad. I don't know. It, it wasn't me. Oh, are there any more Bitch. invitations to send, or are we <laughs> finally done with the curse of things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. A Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I wonder who that could be. Who's at the door? Oh, cold boy. For Lady Mira Forrester. Ah. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. Yuri Lowenthal, huh? I'm surprised he's doing a Telltale what game. Is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asked that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenn will remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? Uh. She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. She knows your influence. She knows you're very influential. She's not entirely wrong. Right, so, I mean... A letter I mean... from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But we but fucked up in the first episode. You'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. Right, right. We fucked up before. So I'm... I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. Well, I... I don't fucking know. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. I'm kind of weary of Marjorie. I really am. I feel like in a way, like, there, I, cause like, I feel like there isn't much we can expect from her anymore. Cause like, I feel like I should have said no on the first episode from asking Marjorie to try to get that late uh, Cersei's dumbass, uh, brother, son, incest, kids help. So that was partially my fault. Nah, nah, we already fucked up once. Don't want to risk it. I'm sorry, Roderick. I mean, we fucked so up once. So, I wouldn't want to risk anything else to happen. You know what I mean? Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Bitch, don't come in here bursting. Sir Maynard. Oh, the man's breath smells like a brew house. 
I was hoping I'd catch you at something slightly more exciting. A love letter, perhaps? Bitch, listen, no. Or a declaration. This ain't high this ain't high school musical in this bitch. Very busy with Lady Marjorie and and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. Okay, what you got on your mind, sister? Spit if it. If you don't mind. Spill Go it! Ahead, then. Oh, I didn't mean no. to sound like that. It's you sounded bitchy when you said that. I'm gonna spit it out. Should get these letters sent first. Then bit. Do you need any help with them? I've got them. Yeah, wasting my time and shit. Huh? Should have spit it out while we were there. Oh, what the fuck? What we got going on? Hmm. Gary. They look cold, but that black suits Garrett pretty well. Oi, fuckhead! The fuck you say, bitch? But you're in my spot, so move. Fuck off! I ignore your bitch ass. Remember it then, bitch. Most of you will be dead within the year. <sighs> Frostfinger is bloody speech. If you want to survive in the night's watch, listen close. All right, you what you got to say, to man? The wall? the wall was erected Why? over 8,000 years ago. At this the girl I used to fuck now and again. All right. Face like a queen, tits like a whore. That it turned out she was married to some Very people. descriptive. He tried to stick me with this. Stretches for over 300 miles. Okay. That's a nice looking dagger, though. I'm stuck in him instead. That's a nice Assassin's Creed so dagger. Time I say move, you best fucking move. Shut up for once, will you? What's your yeah, fault? shut the fuck up. I'm sick of Finn bragging about all the girls he's fucked. And what dire crime are you here for? Fucking potatoes. Fucking potato potatoes? You were fucking potatoes? You for fuck potatoes? potatoes? Yeah, right. I stole them. That's what got me sent to the wall. Nobody cares, thief. But that's don't a petty. That. But I don't think you would get sent to the wall for a petty thief. I think you would get sent to, to jail, to, right? So, Oi, my sister was on. I've got something for your sister. Fucking talk about my sister. All right, all right, guys. Stop arguing. Who in seven hells is talking back there? Not me. Uh. I'm gonna stay quiet on that one. Who was it? Uh, uh. Fuck it, I'm snitching. We're arguing. You fucking right. Not wise to point the finger at your new brothers. Fuck them. They're not my brothers yet. Garrett Tuttle here wants to be a ranger, so we can go north of the wall and die on some wildling spear. But what he wants doesn't mean shit. It never does. So today you're all gonna show me what you're made of. Can you swing a sword? Shoot Can a you bow? shoot a bow? Are you strong? Listen, listen. Those who do well. I play Dynasty Warriors. <laughs> rest of you. They test you with that shit. Frostfinger. I've shot a bow. I've shot a. The way. Need a word. I've shot a bow, a rifle. I've used a sword. Go on. A board sword. And I'm kind of strong. Best hey, of fuck. luck, Tuttle. Yeah, you too, Yuri Lowenthal. Fucking no, no voice differentiation, having no. bastard. Here we go. <laughs> Again. Woo! Bows up. See those dummies? Those are I wonder what they're going to go talk about. Fuck you looking at frostbite. And that's my new name for you. Frostbite. Castle Black. Castle Black. This is home now. Well guys, I'm gonna end this episode of Game of Thrones episode two right here. If you like this episode, please feel free to give it a like, share, and motherfucking subscribe. This has been your host Keith KNR. And with that being said, guys, 
I'll see you guys next time. Thank you, and have a great, awesome day.